And we continue following breaking news this midday that has stunned athletes and Olympic organizers preparing for the 2020 Tokyo Olympic Games. Kansas City Olympic gymnast Kara Aker has tested positive for COVID-19. 41 Action News anchor Lindsay Shively just returned from talking with Kara's parents. And Lindsay, they've got to be concerned. What do they say? Oh, and, and their child's halfway around the yeah. world when they find this out, right, Cynthia? Yeah, they say right now she doesn't have any symptoms. She feels fine. And while she's obviously disappointed, they say, honestly, she's accepted it and that she was vaccinated also. We are just incredibly thankful that we got her vaccinated because everybody's telling us, all the medical personnel are telling us that that's, you know, to her benefit. Yeah. And so if I say anything to anybody, I'd like take this seriously, you know? Well, mostly disappointed, you know, I'm, I'm, I feel bad for her because like I said, she's trained most of her life for this. And like I said, there was hope up to this point, even as an alternate, there's always hope that, uh, you know, you might be a, get a chance to compete. So that keeps you going, it keeps you motivated. But now that this results has come back, the, that hope is gone. So as you can imagine, the Acres say they are really looking forward to getting to see her and hug her after she is out of isolation and comes home from Tokyo. Cynthia back. To All right, thank you, Lindsay. Uh, Kara's teammate, Leanne Wong, is also in quarantine. They both train at Gage Center in Blue Springs. You can catch up with the latest on this story at KSHB.com. You can also stay connected with the KSHB 41 News app.